review where we review so you don't have to. Today I'm making a special video just because I'm so impressed with this knife. I had to get it out there. I was going to do it later on. But this thing is an actual small little beast that I suggest you get one and 100% taking camping with you. Or even just using it around the house. I use this thing, I would say, almost every day. Uh, it's just absolutely amazing. I believe I... I know I picked this up on Amazon. I think it was for around 20, 20 bucks, I think. Not very expensive. Um, has a nice plastic case. It actually clicks in, so it holds it really, really well. Has a nice clip for your belt, which I like that this pulls up, so that way you don't have to actually take your whole belt off to get it off. Or if you wear cowboy boots, you could also slide it down inside your boot, and it will hold there pretty well. It's got a nice lock system. I mean, there's quite a bit of tension there. So you will not have any issues with that popping off. And the blade is a little bit dirty because, like I said, I use this thing all the time. I mean, from cutting vegetables to cutting fruit to splitting wood, I have beat the ever-living, excuse my language, but shit out of this thing. And you can't even tell. The blade is in almost perfect condition still. Like I said, sorry for it being dirty, but <clears throat> I sharpened this thing one time and haven't touched it since. Um, I use it for splitting four to six inch logs for burning. I mean, I've actually hammered the top of this blade and you can't even tell. I've tried to pretty much honestly break it and... I was sore at the end of the day after using this thing outside splitting wood because it would just not give. It has a nice rubberized handle, so if you do get it wet or you just wash it, you won't lose your grip. I'd say overall, it's about 8 inches long or so, 9 inches, but definitely pick this thing up if you can find it. Made in Sweden, I have to say... This is probably one of the best knives I've ever had, especially for the money. You can't beat it. I did purchase another knife here. It is a pretty chunky guy. I'll be reviewing that here in the near future. I'll shoot out some pictures and stuff in one of the trailers so you guys can check it out. It's also a very well-made knife. But, yeah, guys, hope you liked the review. Uh, definitely pick this thing up. Like I said, I got this on Amazon, and it has been one of the best knives I've ever had. I hope you enjoy the review. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and have a great day. God bless.